The submission name is the first thing a reader will see when viewing your submission. It is important to have a descriptive and intelligible title. The submission name will be visible to the broader scientific community and should describe the data in your data submission. Avoid using internal project language, such as deliverables or DOE project numbers. Try to include specifics about what makes the data in your submission unique. Consider including the location of your data, especially if it is helpful for context or differentiating these data from other datasets. When coming up with a submission name, try to avoid generic project names, abbreviations that would be unclear to someone outside the project, or project identification numbers. The general public should be able to comprehend most, if not all, of the submission name. You may want to follow this template. Project name, if concise and widely used. Specific topic that the data pertain to. And the location that the data apply to. Note that this is a general template and will not always fit your specific dataset. The submission name should ideally be between 5 and 10 words. It may also help to write the submission name after the abstract and keyword sections have been completed. The submission name gives a clear idea of what the data in the submission will include. From this example, it is known that Newton's second law is being investigated and an experiment was done that utilizes a cart and a pulley. In this example, a project name is not included because we do not have a widely used name that refers to this group of experiments. A location is not included in this example because it is not relevant to the experiment or its results. 